Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do another reading for the 16th. Just because, you know, I like to be fair. This is for all signs, whoever it resonates with, it will not resonate with every single person. Timing is fluid, keep that in mind as well. My favorite card, you know it is. <laughs> well, done. We're done. We don't need to go any further. Just kidding. Just kidding. Man holding heart. I mean, what more can I say other than we have an offer here? We have an offer of love from man. Or this man's heart has been ripped out. Could go either way, huh? Considering the last reading I just did. Feel free to watch it. He probably has a better opportunity considering the reading I just did. He may meet, maybe, maybe he's decided he's going to give his heart to somebody who deserves it. Who is this mystery man anyway? That's what I'd like to know. Door to spirit. Spirit's bringing him. There's that dove. Oh, well, yeah, he thought about it long enough, hopefully. Yeah, he's got, he's definitely got something in his hand. This man that's coming has something in his hand. This is like a jewel or it's a, you know, I don't know what it is, but it's a gem, gem of some sort. He's thinking, he's thinking about. Giving it away. Huh. Should I keep it or should I give it away? Well, I think you should give it away. Yeah, communication, the fifth chakra. This is the throat chakra. Communicate, communicate, communicate. So it looks as though the truth. He's being divinely guided. He's been enlightened. He's being divinely guided to speak up. Open his heart. To whoever it is he's been thinking about. He is absolutely being divinely guided to do so. So this man is obviously leaving something else. According to the last reading. Unless this is a different man. It definitely could be a different man. These men look a little bit different. So there's there could be two men here. Just saying. We got one man who's thinking about it. And one man who is like. He's, he's like. He's ready. He's he's more than ready. He's he, this guy just thinking about it. this man actually has it. I mean, his heart is his heart. This man's heart is bigger than this. I mean, the heart is bigger than a jewel. I mean, it really is. I'd go for the heart. I'd take the heart if I was you. I mean, you might have a choice between two men for some of you people out there. Ooh, ooh, okay, this is love, the fourth chakra. This is the, the chakra of love. Jeez, <laughs> some crow. Oh, God. So, yeah, somebody is going to be communicating their love. They've been thinking this. This could be the same man. It could be. It could be two men, or it could be the same man. Somebody's been thinking about 
communicating their love. They may be even making, thinking about proposing for some of you. That's true, true love when they do that. You know, when they give you a heart and a rock. I mean, you can't get any better than that. Just saying. Don't get your hopes up. Blossoming abundance. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Sure as hell is. Looks like there's some sort of beautiful, beautiful offer coming in. <laughs> oh, boy. Shit. There's always got to be some shit, doesn't there? Deceit and envy mirroring each other. Yeah, yeah, you're going to need to have strength to get past that bullshit. There's no doubt about it. Caring connection. But if it's meant to be, it's meant to be, right? If it's meant to be, you can get through it. So, I mean, hey. What more can I say? Whoo! So... I think that somebody has been watching. I think that somebody has been waiting and they've been watching and they've been wanting. They've been that envy. They've been wanting. They've been wanting to make a move. But they haven't found the strength to do so. They haven't found the strength, the courage, and the confidence. And perhaps even their pride got in the way because a lion is a symbol of pride. You know? And perhaps, you know, behind the scenes, there was some deception. And now, for them to come forth with their offer, there's going to be some communication about the deception. About the deceit, about the lies. About what happened behind the curtain, behind the scenes. The truth. The truth. But, what's that quote? Oh, true love uh, never fails, or what's the, I don't even know what it is. Because uh, this is what this is. It's, it's love. It's love. True love, you can get through anything. I think there's like a, I don't know what it is, but anyway. That's what this is. This is love. It's a true love connection. True love can overcome any hurdle. So, for some of you, there is a man that is going to come forward with some honest, truthful communication. Rubbing my heart. <laughs> oh, God. Some honest, truthful communication about how he truly feels. And this doesn't mean that it's the person from your past. This could be somebody who has been waiting to communicate with you. But perhaps they, you know, have a bad history. They have a bad reputation. They need to explain where they've been or um, why their last relationship broke up or whatever. Maybe they made a wrong choice in the past and... You know, they want to make an offer to you and they're going to be, they're afraid that, you know, their past is going to um, hinder your decision to accept them. Okay? So this could go a lot of different ways. This could be somebody from the past that is coming from with the truth. This could be somebody completely new or it could be both. That just came to me. It could be both. This could be somebody coming to you uh, very, you know, th that's in your life now or they're coming to you and they have a bad history. They have a bad past. And they got to come to you with the truth about their past. But whatever this is, there's love. There's beautiful, beautiful 
um, opportunity for growth and expansion. This person is being guided into your life by angels, okay, spirits. And, you know, they're hoping, they're praying and they're hoping that you can get past, you can find the strength and the courage to work with them because they feel a deep, deep connection with you. So, this is a man, again, okay, making an offer, not a woman. Not going to keep going. We have a man that is coming in with a genuine offer of love. Hoping that you can get over his past. And that's what this is about. Good luck. I hope it's for you.